Okay, Frank, you've been around the team for a little while now. How has the experience changed since the kind of the moment you turned up? So obviously now, sort of uh, settled in, um, really enjoying it, being in and around the, the team. Feel sort of part of the team now. Um, yeah, uh, got to know everyone. Everyone's a great set of lads. So just hoping to keep going and uh, get, get uh, go towards promotion. Really. Now. When you joined, obviously joining a successful team that was winning games. Uh, that's a double-edged sword, isn't it? And maybe not so much game time as you wanted, but also being part of a competitive squad must benefit you as well. Yeah. So although maybe I might not be getting the the minutes that I, I want to get, it's sort of. I'm part of a team which is doing really well and that's obviously good for me as well. Um, the main thing now is really just to, to push for that promotion and uh, keep winning games. Um, also gaining a lot of experience from being in and around like a, a first team for sort of the first time. So just sort of got to keep taking the positives and just uh, coming in every day and just working hard. What have you made of the, uh, the setup we've got here? Obviously we're at South Devon College today. Um, we've got some great facilities and uh, that must uh, make your time at the club uh, even better? Yeah, for sure. Like, I was really impressed with it when I first came in. I was thinking like, this Torquay United is not a Conference South club. Like, They really should be a lot higher. So all of us are sort of just sort of trying to get the get the club beat, uh, to where it needs to be. And what about your relationship with the players? That must have uh, grown over the time you've been here. Yeah, so obviously I got to know quite a lot of the boys quite well. Uh, I live with uh, with a couple of them, uh, Ben Winter and Calvin Kalala, who are great lads. Um, and yeah, everyone's just been been really welcoming since I got here, and I've just sort of tried to get on with them, see who I've got good relationships with on the pitch and stuff. Um, and yeah, just uh, continue to train hard with them, and just uh, we're all pushing towards the same thing. We've got Concord Rangers on Saturday. It's uh, that delicate balance of obviously looking at the opposition and concentrating on ourselves isn't it yeah so it's a it's, every game now is a is a cup final which gaffer keeps saying which is true like every game now is a step closer to where where we want to be so we just got to work hard and work well as a team keep that team togetherness and hopefully we'll be fine it's another long trip for us but it's also another long trip for our fans uh, what have you made of their support so far uh, fans are unreal like that's the first thing I really noticed when I came in like when I came on at home it was like yeah just my first day I felt like a, a real footballer sort of thing like it was heard one of them like come on Vincent and I was thinking like this is like my whole life I've been working towards this so yeah just uh, hope they keep going and keep being as supportive as they have been um, I noticed as well when we went down to 10 men on uh, last Saturday against Dartford they sort of really rallied together and, and got the team going which I think sort of helped us get basically another man on the pitch sort of thing, kind of help drive the lads. So, um, yeah, really pleased with the fans, yeah. Well, we'll let you get to training. Thanks for joining us. All right, thanks a lot.